Hey, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Astros versus Angels Major League Baseball matchup on Friday, August 11th, 2023. Here on YouTube, I do tons of free pick videos, so be sure to subscribe to our channel. We do free picks every day, SportsChatPlace.com, PickDogs.com, right here on YouTube, as well as across social media and our live shows. And when you give out that many free picks, you're bound to like some games more than others. To find out which games those are, as well as to get best bets from the world's best handicappers, head on over to our website, PickDogs.com. Click on the Premium Picks tab. While you're there, use the discount code PICK. You'll get 15% off any purchase or combined purchases of $19 or more. We also now have the Pick Dogs Dime Club. This one's geared towards bettors that make uh, that bet at least 1000 bucks a game. So it's not for everyone. If it is for you, though, call the toll-free number, text the number. You'll talk to a live person and see if it is for you. But let's get to this one. Got the Astros against the Angels, and well, it's that time of year, and here come the Houston Astros. This is a team where, you know, the World Series has gone through Houston for about the last five years straight. I'm not saying the Astros have won five straight World Series, but they certainly have been in the mix every single year, at least the last five years. And, of course, last year, bringing it all the way home. And, uh, you know, I, I do believe that we're starting to see the Astros play that style of baseball. I think, you know, for several reasons here. Number one is, of course, that they've gotten healthy. And I think, you know, having, uh, you know, Alvarez and Altuve back in the lineup is a big piece of it for this Astros team. That doesn't really have the depth of some of these past Astro teams. And that's all part of winning. You know, when you win... Your, your good players and your good bench players, your good bench players, they want to go other places where they can play full time. And your good players, well, they want a lot of money to stay around. So that combination usually means that turnover rate and also a lot of that great depth, those players that were sitting on the bench that were so good, um, no longer with you. And, you know, the Astros, this is just their time. They know how to win. They have those guys that have won before. So it's like, you know. It, once you win, all you want to do is continue winning, right? It's not like, oh, well, I won my World Series. I'm good, right? And it's not the way that it really works. Justin Verlander on the mound here for the Astros. He was brought back by Houston. I'm not really sure why they let him go in the first place. I guess they just didn't want to pay him that bundle of money that he ended up fetching from the New York Mets. But uh, Verlander just seems like a natural fit here with this Astros team. And he's, you know, watching him pitch for this team, even though it hasn't been a perfect return. Um what it has seen is just he seems to have that comfort level with this team, and I think the team has the comfort level with him. And uh, I think this is probably a pretty good combination for both these guys. On the other side of this one, the Los Angeles Angels, what can we really say at this point? This is a team that really made one of the biggest mistakes in recent years, not trading Shohei Otani. And I think it's one of those things, if you trade Shohei Otani and you got to hear about it forever, well, at least you got something back for him and I think you know in this case they're going to end up with nothing back no playoffs do not pass go do not collect $200 in fact we're going to pound the Astros here as well I'm going to take the Astros and that's going to be my free pick of course while you're doing your picks today putting your bets in be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com our betting tools are 100% free and the way they work they show you just how often all the bets on the board today actually hit then they show you today's odds and from there you can assess the risk reward putting yourself on the bets that come in the most and pay the most that's how you make money betting on sports.